what is up it's AD here with US squads hope you're having a wonderful day uh, as you can see a little zombie theme stuff going on here this is this video is going to be a unbox and review a quickie review of a firearm but we're going to kind of s s do a little segment here um, as you know everybody's going a little crazy about the zombie theme uh, thank you Sydney people give me cool gifts because they know I like the zombie stuff so one of my friends she hooked me up with uh, these playing cards which I will open someday um, but check you've seen my other videos where I talk about the Hornady zombie max ammunition you know uh, Hornady is basically taking their high-end ammunition and putting a zombie theme to it a lime green basically coloring to their ammunition I just got these this double O buckshot and this is uh, some of their high-end shotgun ammunition that they put a little zombie max on there lime green with the coloring here which is kind of cool and then they have the cool box that you know gives you your let you know this is zombie max ammo zombie 101 how to survive a zombie attack anyway cool stuff but that's not what we're talking about today we're talking about Ruger now Ruger is a great firearms company they make very great products and they are on the bandwagon also zombie defense kit you can't see it because the sticker but that's what it says so what does this mean this is the Ruger LCP light compact pistol if you've seen my other videos you've seen my carry weapon this is a Ruger LCP chambered in 380 auto semi-automatic but we're not talking about this one we're talking about this one the zombie defense kit so let's do a quick unboxing show you what's in the box and then I'm gonna go over the firearm after so open it up you're gonna have your pistol like so I'm not gonna show this yet this case does not come with it this is a pocket holster uh, that fits in your front or back pocket to give it a wallet fill but it does not come with it MSRP on this bad boy at Cabela's was 379 so you have your pistol but not this you have to buy this is like 30 bucks okay let's go over this you have the completely ridiculously obsolete gun lock that they give you which serves no damn purpose other than making the gun manufacturer uh, compliant I guess you're gonna have your um, bag if you ever wonder what's in here and if you haven't opened it it's basically a spent round the manufacturer will shoot a test round and the person will sign off on it to show that the pistol functioned correctly most manufacturers include this one round in your box you're gonna have your instruction manual cleaning kit special offers sales packet all the stuff here NRA stuff and that's gonna be like that they're going to give you a little case, which is, again, obsolete. You're not going to use it, but you can carry it. You know, if you're traveling and you need to store it, this would be a nice soft case to protect the finish and protect your firearm. It's much bigger than the pistol, so it fits nicely in there, but it's not really a pocket a holster by all means. And then you're going to have, I swear, when I bought my LCP, I had two magazines, but they're going to include a extended magazine grip thing that goes on the bottom here that you can change out see how this is smooth this has a little bit more of an uh, edge to it so it actually is a finger groove so your fingers kind of grip this pistol a little bit better um, I don't see two magazines there's only one so I guess this only has one magazine now for the unveiling check that out so this is the LCP Z Z for zombie I'm gonna put on the macro here and this is actually etched into the the uh, steel slide and on the other side BAM zombie slayer and this is also etched into the slide with a little red and the lime green so Ruger has gone on the bad wagon this is the LCP Z light compact pistol zombie killer pretty cool pretty cool little pistol now in conjunction with our 380 ammunition um, we have the zombie max lime green 380 super bullets here and that's pretty cool this ammunition is very cool so this would match this theme perfectly which is what we did and so that's it now some specs on this this is uh, you can check out my other video I'll put the episode list here to show you how to field strip the LCP in general in case you want to know in case you uh, are curious about this but let me go over some specs okay basically 379 MSRP on this um, it's 3.6 inches tall 5 inches long approximately 0 0.80 inches thick okay this is a pocket pistol this is a concealed weapons carry a backup pistol um, magazine holds six 
plus one. So you can actually have a total of seven rounds total in this pistol. Six in the magazine and one chambered if you desire. Or six flat. You can carry six rounds and then none in the chamber depending on your comfort level. Um, there is no safety on this pistol. Um, the safety is right here. And also it has a very, very tough trigger pull. So let's say, watch this. This is, let me just triple check to make sure there's no rounds in there. Watch how much energy, how much tension I have to put to disengage this. See that? Okay. So that's a really tough trigger pull. I don't know what pound it's set at, but it takes quite a bit of travel for it to, to engage. Um, I carry mine loaded with one, um, and I carry it in this holster, which protects the trigger. So you're not, it's going to be hard to get at that, but you know, when you get it, draw, aim, finger on the trigger and do your thing, right? So this is it. Um, this is a steel blue slide with a nylon filled frame, um, very durable. Um, as far as we go, as far as pistols, let me show you one. This is side by side comparison. It's gonna be identical, and mine's dirty because it has lint and stuff in it because I carried it in my pockets. But as you can see, this is the exact same pistol. Another thing I like about this versus the bodyguard is that the 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 sights are just really smooth and and low profile sights so they don't snag onto much so that's nice too um, at 10 feet this is a short range weapon you're not going to be uh, shooting 50 yards with this thing this is going to be in a close quarter situation so aim center mass do your thing just don't flinch you're good to go of course you should practice with your firearm but anyway that's it so zombie slayer pretty cool pistol pretty cool theme ruger i give you a thumbs up for making things a little fun um i don't know i have not seen many of these for sale or I've, i usually visit the gun shows pretty frequently but we saw this and we had to buy it so double thumbs up lcp rocks in general and then you know ruger good for you for having some fun and again this is etched into the slide with the paint um, it should be pretty durable, but you know, we'll have to see if this rubs off at all, you know, with some hard use. But uh, so far, we're pretty happy with this pretty cool little zombie slayer. Anyway, any questions, post a comment below. Subscribe. Appreciate you guys watching. Back with some more videos. Talk to you guys soon.